the foreigner. Ngoc Minh Chuan, a widowed former Vietnam War Special Operations Forces soldier, runs a Chinese restaurant in London with his business partner Lam. When his teenage daughter Fan is killed in a terrorist bombing, Chuan seeks revenge. The British police discover an IRA codeword was used in the bombing and an Irish Republican group calling itself the Authentic IRA claims responsibility. Chuan takes to visiting Scotland Yard daily, asking for names of the bombers, but is told by Commander Bromley that his visits are diverting resources away from the investigation. Bromley advises Chuan to be patient and warns him against going after the IRA. Undeterred, Chuan takes matters into his own hands and turns his attention to the Northern Ireland Deputy First Minister and Sinn Féin politician Liam Hennessy, a former provisional IRA leader who has since claimed to have renounced violence. Chuan purchases items to make homemade weapons and travels to Belfast, leaving the restaurant under Lamb's control. Chuan seeks out Hennessy at his office but Hennessy claims to have no knowledge of the perpetrators before ejecting him from the premises. Chuan does not believe him, and sets off a homemade bomb in Hennessy's building before leaving a fake explosive on Hennessy's car as warnings. Hennessy tells his men to find Chuan and stop him. Under pressure from the British government and hoping to shore up his position ahead of Northern Irish Assembly elections, Hennessy tries to identify the culprits with help from his former IRA comrades. He orders that known IRA weapons dumps be searched for missing Semtex. Hennessy's bodyguards, led by his right-hand man, Jim Cavanaugh, find Chuan at his guesthouse but he fights them off and escapes. Chuan later observes Hennessy with his mistress Maggie and photographs them kissing in a restaurant. Chuan then brings the fight to Hennessy, hiding in the trees outside his farmhouse and attacking it with more explosives. As Hennessy's henchmen attempt to track him, Chuan disables them with traps and attempts to interrogate one, but is shot in the shoulder by Kavanaugh and flees.